What's up trading nerds and welcome to my new series from Zero to AlgoTrader. It will be a series where I start from scratch and develop a trading framework. To then be able to test different strategies, optimize those and build a trading bot for that strategy. To hopefully at some point go live and earn some nice profits. In this first episode I will give an introduction and overview of the series and tell you what to expect. So. Let's get started. First of all, this series won't follow a linear path because I want to share every step I take. And if, for example, the strategy doesn't work as expected, we will have to go back to the drawing board. However, there will be some important milestones that need to be achieved in order to move forward. And also, this is not going to be some kind of tutorial series. Instead, this is going to be more of a devlog type of series where I'm explaining every step in general, talk about some interesting findings and just capture the journey. If you want to follow me on this journey, subscribe to the channel to not miss any of the upcoming episodes. So the first step is to get some data. I will program a pipeline to store historical data locally to be then be able to load the data fast and easy. I also plan to build a user interface to plot the data as a candlestick chart and also then be able to plot some indicators on them. After that I can start to build a framework for the backtesting. I thought a long time about just using an existing framework like Backtrader or VectorBT and I already did some tests with VectorBT but I think it's better to develop my own framework instead of just learning one specific niche framework where I don't know if it's still actively maintained in a few months. But building such a framework is a lot to do. It has to handle trading signals like buy and sell orders, stop loss and take profits, the trade execution which means to set the size of the orders based on some calculated risk and also handling fees and slippage. If the framework can calculate all these trades, it has to accumulate the results and calculate some backtesting metrics. These can be for example some drawdown and PL calculations. This framework can then be tested with some simple strategies. I also want to be able to optimize the strategies. This means setting a range of parameters that are then all automatically backtested. If I think the strategy might be profitable in live markets, I want to connect a trading bot to a broker. This can either be done by an API of the broker or over some third party applications like MetaTrader. This trading bot needs then to be hosted on a server because I don't want to run it locally 24 7 on my machine. As you can see there's much work to do. So if you are interested in this series show it to me by liking this video. I'm excited to see you in the next episode from Zero to AlgoTrader where I'm going to build a database and maybe also start writing some code. See you then.